Konnichiwa YouTubers, this is Red Stock straight from Point Magoo, California. Today we're going to do a video review of PlayStation 2 game. I don't have the game, unfortunately, but I do want it, I did want the Figma, so I got that. <laughs> it is Suzumiya Haruhi no Tomadoi. So if you want to get this game, go get it. I thought it was going to come with a game. Gosh, I wish I knew more Japanese because when I bought it, I said, hey, the Figma is unopened. That's cool. Uh, yeah, it's a PlayStation 2 game. Came with a figure. Kind of neat. Japan is awesome like that. PlayStation 2. And yeah, it's definitely Moe. No doubt about that. There's the top of the box. Side of the box, same thing. Suzumiya. Suzumiya Haruhi no Tomadoi. And bottom of the box. Not much. I do like the artwork in the back. You guys watch that anime? I do not. It's a basic little figure. It doesn't come with much. Not gonna lie. Pretty decent actually what how it stands its articulation is pretty good it's revoltech so oh sorry it's figma not revoltech what well, made you thought it was a uh, revoltech probably because the joints but yeah it's a figma comes with a sword as you can see or a fencing sword she cooled she could do a welded but for some odd reason i don't like it because the fact it looks like it's for fencing but she will have no trouble doing it just have to it actually does come undone here like so so, if she need be, yeah, she can dual weld. Yeah, no problem. I just don't like it. So, there we go. Comes with a sword. And she does come with four additional pair of arms, hands. So, it's not too bad. It is a little, neat little finger mill. Also comes with a face and a stand little Figma stand that we're used to and a little attachment point in the back really don't need to use it I like the bow too it has an articulated bow but she stands well on her own really don't need the stand okay just like any other Figma this is a very basic Figma I'm not gonna lie so the to change your face just basically pop it out Pop this back in. As you can see, you got that little Figma joint over here. So you get ball joint in the neck. Paint apps aren't as great as a... I guess it's because it is a PlayStation. So if you see, notice the Figmas, they're not as good. There are little paint spot splotches on there. The face is pretty good. I like that. Chocolate brown hair here. Looking good, actually. Put this sword back in. And to pop out the hands is relatively easy. They just pop out. And just pop in. Articulation is what you would expect. So there you go. Ball jointed head. You can see the ball joint. I like the back here. The bows themselves just individually are ball jointed. So they can be posed. Which is kind of neat. A big huge skirt piece. You can see. Doesn't ha has a upper torso rotation and a waist rotation so you, you can pose her I think it's an upper thigh rotation yep ball jointed hip single joint on the knee which I'm not a big fan here and the figma joint as you I, I love the figma joint but this is just a, not articulation is not nearly as great as a regular figmas which I happen to have one for size comparison of course so, yeah, it is what it is. I do like the colors. I look, like the browns, the different color brown, the red, the blue. It works. I even like the detailing on this. It is for a PlayStation game, so it's kind of like an extra. It's a little bonus. Fortunately, I don't have the PlayStation game with me, so I, you can't compare it. Now, for size comparison, there it, she is with Megatron. And move this back just a tad. And... Here's a real Figma with much better detailing. So you, you have a good comparison right there with Samus. Which I like to bring because she is like a 6 inch figure. So you can kind of figure out. So yeah, she's tiny. She's like 4.5 inches. She's smaller than usual. Samus is not quite 6 inches. But you can see. I mean it is what it is. I'll, I'll give it a 6 out of 10. Worthwhile attempt. But not quite there. Get it if you can get the PlayStation game, and I like to see the detail on that. But definitely, 
it's a nice little extra. Get it if you can get it sealed with the PlayStation game. By all means, buy, buy it. I thought I was going to get the PlayStation game, so I said, eh, let's take a risk. Uh, yeah, get the PlayStation game with this. If not, it's not worth it. That's all I got, YouTubers, and I'll catch you all next time.